Hello Cancer, welcome, I'm Ryan, thank you for being here. This is going to be a general reading for you to be dealing with. Of course everything may not resonate, so take what does and leave the rest. And for more tarot readings after this, please check out my wife's channel, Route 33 Tarot, which is a review as well. Thank you. See what's going on. jumping into this cancer what they show me they're making a pretty serious decision here and it definitely feels regarding their work career finances um maybe they're just their money and their investments i feel like it's all the above though i think it's everything this is like money management um and they're making a decision and they're kind of sticking to it they're saying you know what i gotta make some changes i gotta shift some things around even though it's kind of like mm, there's a lot of information to take in and kind of sort through and you know straighten out but they're doing it um they're saying they're making these changes to make things easier to take care of and deal with. But not only that, financially speaking, it is amounting to some sort of growth in revenue and resources. Nice. Um, that being said, they also have some sort of plans here regarding the future in their business and career to kind of have things move forward and speed up. This is creating a whole lot of energy of confidence within and for themselves. Um, it's almost kind of like, can we get a, you know, can we get a rewind? Can we get a playback? Kind of like a, a sports show on television. Um, they're having that moment with themselves of like, wow, they really did that. Really, They kind of really pulled that off and they accomplished that. Yeah, they did. Um, but then comes the situation regarding overall with everything and money. There's a lot, once again, to sort through. Um, I kind of feel like when it comes to their money, their career, maybe their contract, their niche, a, a lot to kind of just straighten out emotionally and mentally to kind of figure out if they are actually on track or in alignment with the way they want things to be going or moving forward. Because what they're showing me is the longer they sit with their whole financial situation or career, they're beginning to not be sure exactly where they're at anymore. Um, it's almost kind of like bigger picture. They, they did something once. But now moving forward, they're saying it needs to kind of be, how do I say this? Um, it needs something more. For some reason, I kind of hear the word upgrade. Something more, something bigger, something greater. Uh, upgrade. I don't know what that is. They're just saying something new. <laughs> it needs to be taken in a completely new direction. Um... Because they definitely have some sort of vision here in mind, and they're being very clear about it. Ooh.
Okay. Very non specific. Um, Okay, so back into this. I feel like, geez, I feel like whatever this new beginning or start is for them, it's definitely a painful one. I, I don't know why. I don't know why. It, it's coming out like, kind of like, um, they just don't know what the future holds for this, this new beginning or this new start. And once again, it, it kind of feels like it's, it's more so regarding their work or their career. They're saying, well, in, intuitively it just feels maybe they should just focus on family, loved ones, friends, um, the relationship, the commitment, stability, security, maybe a living situation. It, it does have this energy of family written all over it. Um, and they're kind of saying, well, let's focus on the positives. Let's focus on the positives because even even though they're, they're doing what they got to do financially to make things work, and that's what's very interesting is they're kind of like saying, yeah, okay, okay. Um, things do work out for them financially and that's what's weird is because they're kind of saying even though it you know they're bringing in some sort of source of revenue or income they're like me it just doesn't matter it doesn't it doesn't mean much to them money is you know it's it, you know it comes and goes is what they're saying at the same time they're still trying to work with it and plan with it so they, they know that money is kind of like a resource it's the tool to use to kind of make things happen and you know change things Yeah, they're just saying it's, it's just business. It's just part of the business. Hmm. Yeah, back to business, back to work. They're kind of, it's interesting. They're kind of saying, it's like, literally this energy. Like they try to make plans to kind of like save up money and resources. At the same time, they realize like those plans aren't necessarily, you know, realistic. That's what's very interesting. It's not very realistic, but they also have that business mindset and understanding like, you know, literally, like as I just stated, money comes and money goes. It's kind of like, there's no sense in trying to hold on to it or hoard money. Um... They're saying, you know what? You just keep moving with it and money keeps flowing. That's how it works. You know, you don't create, in a sense, a swamp. Um, you don't let everything kind of become stale and gross and whatever. It's like, no, it needs constant flow. It needs rushing waters. Um, and even though I kind of feel like that's what it's all about, is they're saying, you know what? About the staleness. They're wanting to clear that up to have some sort of progress and movement, literally movement, um, cause they're realizing something here about the movement and the progress and things moving forward is what's going to create happiness, but it's also what's going to put things back on track. Hmm. Money. Of course, if you are dealing with anyone, you could be dealing with a fire sign, an earth sign, a water sign, or an air sign. Goodbye.